Hi guys! So today we're going to be reading a story called Happy in Our Skin. So we are going to be learning about all the things that make us different and unique and how those things make us special and how we can be happy in our own skin. So this book was written by Fran Hunushkin and was illustrated by Lauren Tobia. So before we start reading any story, we always have to sit up straight, smell the flowers, blow out the candles. And turn on our listening ears. Yay! Okay. Happy in our skin. Look at you. You look so cute in your brand new birthday suit. This is how we all begin. Small and happy in our skin. Bouquets of babies, sweet to hold. Cocoa brown, cinnamon and honey gold. Ginger coloured babies, peaches and cream too. Splendid skin for me and splendid skin for you. It's terrific to have skin. It keeps the outsides out and the insides in. As you keep growing, your skin grows too. Clever skin for me and clever skin for you. Whoops! When you fall, your skin will heal with a scab, a perfect seal. That happens to us all. Sometimes our skin has freckles or birthmarks or dimples. Have a think, what do you have on your face that's different? When we get a tan, it must be sunny. When it's freezing, goose pimples. It's delightful to hug and tickle and wrestle. Get a scrub. A scratch when we itch and hold hands and nestle. Skin covers us from head to toe. It's always there beneath our clothes. Yes, we all have skin, but nobody is you. You are one of a kind. Your fingerprints too. What a wonderful world, such a hullabaloo. With all of us in it, see the splendid view. Bouquets of people, blooming and boisterous, brawny and thin, loving each day. Happy in our skin. So you see, all of us are different. We're very unique. We might have freckles, dimples, a birthmark. We might have different colored skin to our friends, sometimes our family, lots of different people, but those things just make us special. So what I would like you to do now is I'd like you to have a look in the mirror and have a look at all the different things that make you different, unique, and special. Then I would like you to get a piece of paper and draw a self-portrait. So a self-portrait is just a picture of yourself. So to do this, you can go to YouTube and type in the search how to draw a self-portrait. There are lots of different videos to help you. But remember, when it comes to drawing a self-portrait, you need to include all the things about you that make you special. So I have done one myself. Please forgive me, I'm not an artist, but I have drawn my freckles. That's what makes me special. I've got my two big brown eyes. I've got eyebrows, eyelashes. 
I've got curly, 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 curly hair. These are all things that make me different and special. I've got my ears, can't really see them past my hair, but I promise they're fair. Uh, and some big lips. Now, if you have dimples when you smile, two little dots, then don't forget to draw in your dimples. If you have glasses that you wear, don't forget to draw in your glasses. These are all things that make you special. You can also see I've colored in my skin brown because I have brown colored skin. So don't forget to color in the color of your skin as well. All right, boys and girls, have a great day. And don't forget to throw kindness like confetti. See ya.